What up, Boxing World? JF Sports. Supposedly, Klitschko pulled out of the uh, Tyson Fury fight due to a calf injury on yesterday's training, uh, Thursday. Now, you guys know this was an anticipated fight. You know, Klitschko is already fighting a guy like uh, Tyson Fury that is very opinionated, you know, very vocal. And um, as a matter of fact, Tyson, he retaliated that he shouldn't have done the Batman um, show, so to speak, on the press conference because it scared the uh, bitch Klitschko away. That's what he said. You know, news came out this morning. I mean, Klitschko's injury probably is real. You know, it could be all of that. But the fact of the matter that, you know, Tyson Fury was very, very nonchalant and very arrogant and, you know, pursuing the fight. And all of a sudden you backed out of it because for whatever reason, right, even if it's a legit injury, obviously Klitschko's going to get some backlash, right? Not only from Tyson Fury himself, but also from his fans and um, in the boxing world. So, to make this short, um, I think Klitschko um, is aware that uh, Tyson Fury has never lost a fight before and that him being injured coming to the fight you know a couple weeks prior to it's it's an adva a disadvantage to him and a big advantage to Tyson Fury so I mean I don't blame Klitschko for pulling out the fight if the injury is legit all right so I don't blame him for that at all um it's not like this was a mega fight or something like that well where, where people already purchased their tickets and, and hotels and you know book their flights and all that stuff I mean, that would be a different story you know to pull up from the fight like that that would be very controversial but I mean you know it's a big fight I mean it's one of the biggest fight out there as far as heavyweights go and um, you know it, it just sucks that we're not gonna get to see it not October 24th because that was that's was um, that was the original date so um, the uh, next fight is unknown uh, it probably depends on when Klitschko is fully recovered and 100 percent and like i said he wants to fight tyson fury obviously 100 percent you know tyson fury is not the guy that klitschko can overlook that's that's for damn sure you know so i mean on tyson fury's you know side obviously he's gonna say you know that uh, klitschko's docking him dodging him you know and um it is what it is you know what i'm saying and when you get injuries like that you can't help it but also you can't help the uh, backlash and Klitschko's just gonna have to live with it and um, redeem himself on um, fighting Tyson Fury at a later date maybe you know um, early next year or maybe even you know November maybe maybe November December something like that right but he can't he can't wait too long though you know because if he waits too long and especially if he doesn't fight Tyson Fury uh, for his next opponent then he's really gonna get backlash you know what I'm saying like he's He's ducking um, Tyson, so I mean, thought to give you guys a little update on it. So yes, Tyson Fury versus Klitschko, it's not gonna happen. Uh, Klitschko's injured, so that was uh, yesterday's training. Let me know what you guys think. Um, if you think Klitschko's injury is for real, do you think Tyson Fury deserves the right to call Klitschko a little B I T C H? And that um, do you think this fight will ever happen? Or how long do you think Klitschko need to heal up? You know, he was, I think he, he tore a, a tendon in his calf, so it might take a month, two, or something like that, right? Maybe even six months, I don't know. So let me know what you guys think. Drop those comments in the comment section, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. JF Sports, thanks for watching. Subscribe.